What is going on guys? Adam from Troutopia Fishing here. This time I'm doing something completely different. I'm going to do some ultralight fishing today. I'm going to try out the Micro Z-Viber from Euro Tackle. It's, a, it's not even one inch. It's less than half an inch. But it still weighs 1 16th ounce. So I can cast it pretty far. We're elevated right here. So this is really good for, for vertical jigging. So that's what we're going to try it out for today to see whatever bites. I'm expecting panfish, but you never know. We'll see what happens. Oh my god, there's a pickerel right in front of us. Yeah. Alright, let's try. Let's try the hole. It's perfectly clear too. We're fishing the hole, guys. Oh, immediately the hole was there's fish down here. As soon as I dropped it down, yeah, and we caught crappy. Oh, got one. Oh, what the heck? It's big, it's crappy. I, was, I said it. I just said it. There's crappy in there. A oh, freaking crappy. You got the cavalry? Yeah. Cool. They're still there. Let me try it. It's that cover. It's the, the shade, yeah. Look at that black crappy, guys. That's a pretty one, too. I got a picture. I haven't caught one in a while. I haven't fish targeted these guys in quite a bit. Not a big one, but pretty one. That's for sure. Got him, set it. Oh, that's a bluegill that time. Oh, there's another bite. Fish on. I think that's a crappie again. Oh, a big bluegill, okay. At least for this area, that's a good sized bluegill. Oh, he's pretty too, look at the blues on him. I had to call it bluegill. Oh, oh my gosh. As soon as you plop it down there. That's a bait size bluegill there. That might have been the only crappy. <laughs> now I'm just getting bluegill. Might even get a yellow perch too. There's yellow perch in here too. Oh, that's big. That's something nice. That's something nice. Big crappy. Wow. Yo. Nice crappie. Big crappy. Yeah. Never mind. There is more down there, guys. And that's a nice size for this area. Can you get that little micro crankbait back out? Oh, he plopped. All right, going back in. Gulp minnow. On the trout magnet jig head. As soon as I dropped it down. They just don't want the hard bait. They seem to only want a little gulp minnow jig head. It's just too realistic. I just can't resist it. Hooked them good. Bluegill. Remember how to put it on? Yep, you got it. Oh, I got one. Crappy. Yeah, there's a bunch down there, man. Go ahead. There must be a school of them. It's another crappy. Yeah, just make sure you drop it down. It's all the way down. Twitch, twitch, twitch. Lower your pole. Twitch, twitch, twitch. Lower your pole. Now you feel them hit it. Give it a little twitch. They're crappy. What's that? Finally, goodness gracious. Dude. Dude. <laughs> Another good one. Nice crappy. Look at that. 
We should have saved them up. We'd have about 10 of them by now. Ooh. Ooh, nice. Okay, you actually want to start keeping some? That's a good size there. <laughs> that's that's like slow, that's man. like fish fry. I swear, you could have had a fish fry. You want to start head. keeping them? Wait, what time it's is it? Six o'clock. Yeah, Maybe give them some advice so they can catch something. They're using a bopper and a worm. Okay, just open it up. Right, there it goes. All right, you're in the water. Now, um, just reel it shut. There you go. Now, give it a few twitches, just like that. Oh, you got one already. Oh, you missed them. See that? Yeah. Crappy. Uh, crappy. Yay. <laughs> What is going on guys? Adam from Troutopia Fishing here. I just jumped right there. I'm going to try for snakehead for a bit since the water's so low and stagnant. And then, which is usually pretty good for snakehead from my experience. And that doesn't work out. I'm going to Go back upstream and try for crappy at where I was crappy fishing the other day. See what we can do. Unbelievable. Oh, there's a lot of them out here though. Bluegill. They all moved out here. Where did all the crappy go? There's bluegill. It was like instant So I moved over here. Gizzard Shad, bunch of bluegill. Oh, nice size one there. Those crappy go. They were stacked in that tunnel the other day. <laughs> we'll go everywhere. Just fun. Missing those crappy though. Where'd they go? Where'd they go? <laughs> Bring 
vertical jig and bluegill though, those ain't get old. Oh, there it goes. Uh, one inch gulp minnow is so hard to beat for panfish. Gilly, that's a fat one. All around the same size, but that one's fat. Not seeing any other sunfish too. It's all just bluegill. No red breast, no pumpkin seed. No red ear. Alright, let's try this tunnel again. I'm not giving up on it. Alright, it's in. Maybe I gotta do a more subtle jigging. Ooh, that was a bite. Okay, they are still here. They are still here. Ooh, we're on. Not a crappy, but there's something out of the hole. There's still fish down there. Neither had to be. Now where are the crappy? I can't believe there's no one over here. I love it. I gotta do the drop down because you cannot tell if it's in the water unless you do this. Manually bring the line down. Now it's in the water. And you know it's in the water. I think they're just bluegill though because if, if it was some crappy, they, they hold on to it longer and they have bigger mouths. hard to not miss a crappie when a crappie hits it. That's got to be a crappie. He's not coming up. Oh my gosh. What is this? Whoa! Whoa, 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 big, that's the biggest crappie I've pulled out of that hole. Oh man, I knew they were still down there. That's a freaking slab, bro. That's the size of my hand. Let's go, guys, that's the size of my hand. That's a good one for this area. Wow, I might keep him. I couldn't even, I, I, he was getting stuck on the hole. I couldn't even get him out of the hole. Look how dark he is. Look how dark that fish is. That's a slab and a half. In recent years, the, the crappie in recent years in this area have been quite small. So getting one that size, it's, it's really good. Now, he ain't that big in terms of a carp. But that's like... That's a nice size there. All right. Since it's deeper over here, let's just drop down over here as far as it can go and see what I get. Bluegill. Oh, is that something different? No, no, no. That's still bluegill. Pretty one, though.
Figures that's the only crappy I get. The only crappy. Oh, crappy, crappy. No! No! He came out of nowhere. Everywhere I cast, I get a bluegill. <laughs> They're stacked up over here again. Bigger gill. He wanted to taste. That's the biggest gill of the day. I saw him come over. I was like, man, that's a nice gill. That's a picture worthy gill. I had the camera off, y'all, but I finally got the crappy. Uh, I think it's the same one because it's in the same spot. Boom. All right, y'all. I think that about does it. But thank you guys for watching. You already know it. More videos will be on the way soon.